Thomas. I thank God for giving us this beautiful day, for giving us this time. I warmly welcome each and every one of you present here. Uh, I hope and believe that we are going to have a very fruitful time together today. I also believe uh, that we are going to learn and we are going to learn a lot from our very dynamic uh, resource persons. I extend my warm greetings and heartfelt gratitude to all our resource persons present here. Thank you so much for availing your time and taking out your time to be here with us this, this morning. We will now start with the introductory session. To invoke God's presence in our midst, I would like to call upon Ms. Lily, Director, Christian Education Department, YBBK. Kim Chumur Baptist, Kim Chumur Baptist, Bora Gohima, respected Ms. Lily, Director, Children Education Department, Director, YBBK, respected Engineer Gesogu Witsa, respected Hiryo Bol, respected Major Rako, respected Mr. Nito Kamo, Res mo respected Mpewe Tini Kamo, respected Tosh Mr. Toshi Kim Kyung, Mr. Renshido Limbs, Ms. Zekyangla, and all the delegates, distinguished delegates, welcome you to the Yimchung Students Union Kohima Gear Guidance under the theme Gallows of Profession. As a part of YSK, the union put an effort to help its students to achieve their goals in securing future jobs, internships, and go ops. I believe that on this event, our students will have the opportunity to meet future and will be inspired to work hard and commit to the pursuit of their future goals. Kita sila nasagad ka aradon Yimchong students yun ko himana nasagad ka dito akiru ba aralan na asa deji yocho asa debi yocho ha yimchong students yun ko hima ne kira ka dito sa lugi ha ko besi dito sa nulucho hacing abo delegates po apu abo isa na jika mala tucing abo isa na yimla akiru ba dito aralan na durobo kini ara kya mung hitso ale she told him, Billy, and Atsua at the Sunday, Plumla Adozo Ale. It is show in Tom Student Student for Human Officials Activities for Junusaki Giotto. We're in the Yim Tom Student Student for Human has arranged a small token of love and appreciation. So, as I call up, call up your name, I request you to. Come over to the stage. Government officer, urban development, Nagai. And here we have Sir Wong Tokyo Pastor Yim Chung Yim Chung Baptist Bora Kohima. Next, we have Mr. Toshi Yimkyung, singer and songwriter. And next, we have Mr. Renshito Limbs. Next, we have Madam Tansola Brasden. Yim Kyung Women Organization for Human Unit. <laughs> Miss Lily 
Children Education Department Director Imchumur Baptist Burg Bohima. Miss Zichangla. And next we have Nagaland uh, NLTV. Uh, 
now we call it Assistant Urban Development Officer. So, um, uh, so right now I am the Assistant Urban Development Officer posted in Peg and Kipri. So, uh, journey throughout. So, I straight go away into the uh, exam, exam preparation strategy, the, the topic which I've been entrusted with. So, before we start, I'd like to ask the students know that how many of you here are um, trying for examinations, be it technical examinations or um, civil service examinations? Can I please see your hands? Okay, yeah. So, that's nice. I hope this will be a fruitful session for all of us. Mm. First, um, I believe, no, to start anything, be it talking from strictly from an examination point of view. So first you have to uh, decide. No. To appear in the examination you have to be very sure, like a um, straight cut. Okay, this is what I want to do with my life. Now I I want to do I want to appear this examination. Like you have to first know in life what you want in your life. And uh, why do you want to do it? You want something so badly that you're willing to give your um, time and energy to it, but you have to know why you want to do it, so that along the journey, the passion will not die. So, why do you want to do it? This uh, question was asked by one of my teachers in the coaching class, and he gave a very wonderful answer. Uh, like, we're doing this, we're studying, we're struggling, so that we make a better lives for ourselves and our family. So, I think that is a good enough reason to go forward with and yeah, so you have to make a decision that I'm going to study for this exam and make the decision and stick with it. No? And number two, no, after you decide what you want to do, you have to, make a, you have, to have an aim. Because there are so many exams, like, you can't go on, um, because our mind is also not limitless. We have to, um, okay, firstly, you have to be ambitious with your aim. No? And you have to be, an aim you should have, it should be specific what you want. Because uh, the NPC comes up with at least uh, three examinations in a year. Of course, you can focus on every examination and give your full to each, so you have to decide. You have to decide which exam you want. Example, uh, if you're preparing for the NCS or NPS Allied Services, your preparation, your strategy will be different. And if you're going for technical examinations or you know, combined educational service examinations, your your strategies will change based on the exam. So I hope all of us are following. And um, so you have to be so. Now we're in 2021. So if you're aiming for NPC prelims, which is uh, scheduled on 27 November this month. Uh, you have to have a aim. So by 2022, this month, I have to be prepared like this. So make a plan, you know, have a straight cut, ambition and plan. And after that, um, after the aim, yeah, you have to make a plan, a time frame, because uh, you have to know time management also. So you have to plan. Okay, by 2023, if you're trying for UPC, or by 24, you no, know, make a time frame, a plan. Then, by this time, I have to finish studying this, and by this time, I will crack this exam. Uh, firm uh, believe that I'll be able to do it. And so, um, when you plan, the, I always tell my friends also, like, uh, first thing, you have to know the syllabus, no? NPC, or like, every examination, whenever they advertise, they advertise with the syllabus already. So, uh, we can't just go on studying blank, no, like, without any straight cut or specific plans. We have to be very sure, okay, this is the syllabus. This, to crack this examination, I'm expected to know these things. I'm expected to be well versed in these things. So, that is all set out in the syllabus. And after that, um, you have to uh, get acquainted with the pattern and question papers. Because, um, examinations, like, um, if you look very carefully, all examination question papers have a certain pattern. If you catch a pattern and if you 
study the question paper carefully, you, you get to know, I'm sure, like, you get to know that these are the things or this is the way they ask questions or we should know that from what angle they're asking, no, they, they will, uh, like, the question setters don't just set exams uh, out of the blue, like, there's always some relevance to what's happening in the world also. So, um, the, uh, study the syllabus, the question uh, pattern, and the previous year's question. So when you, when you get when you come to that, you have a um, a holistic view, starting from your plan to the exam. You have a holistic view. Okay, this is what I'm expected to do. This is what I'm expected to know. So the plan. So um, after that, I would like to. Okay, I'll go to study strategies now. How exactly the tangible part of this conversation, what you can actually do. But before that, I'll uh, share something. Um, I did my master's in urban planning now. So I finished my urban planning in the 2018, I completed my master's. I came back home in July. So that time, um, there was no vacancies for urban planners in the state. Um, the last advertised post was in 2011 and we friends are fellow urban planners. We were not uh, expecting the government to notify or uh, not advertise post. So that time I had a decision to make. Now I have, a, I have two options, uh, either to go for civil service examinations or uh, combined technical examinations with my civil engineering paper. So that time I made a decision. I thought like, um, what is it that I want to do? No. So um, I that time I decided that okay, I have a degree in engineering, but I would like to pursue um, the NCS NPS Allied Service. So I came home in July 2018. Right away by August I joined a coaching coaching center because I. I needed coaching because I'm from engineering background and I'm not aware of the art subjects. No. So coaching was a necessary thing for me. Then I joined coaching. So that's how uh, my study preparation strategy started. Mm, I will share my personal experiences throughout the coaching. So approximately eight months of coaching I had to learn uh, modern history, are like art subjects, no? political science, economics, so all those were very new to me, but then I loved learning those things because um, okay, engineering is a very technical subject, no? it can be applicable to um, in society when it comes to houses or roads and bridges, but then when you study the art subjects, like I can relate it to the newspaper.